guys, welcome back to Together with Electronics. This is episode number 8 and it's also the second part of the tutorial on how to use uh, RTC interface in your next project. Today we'll be actually configuring the chip and uh, programming it with the real time. So hopefully we'll get some action. And if you have not uh, watched the previous video, I suggest you do so. Uh, click on the link you see right here. Uh, so sit back, relax and enjoy the video. Okay, first up, we'll open up the Arduino IDE and then we need to add a couple of libraries for this function to work. So we go to Google Chrome and then we search for DS1307 RTC.h Arduino and click on the first link you see here and it should take you to the Arduino website. Then you click on the link that says DS1307 RTC and it directs you to a page where it asks you to download this zip file. So go ahead and do it. And uh, this uh, DS1307 is also also requires another library called time. So uh, download that as well. So now what you need to do is install the libraries. Okay, once you've successfully installed your libraries, you should have a couple of new examples. So go ahead and choose set time okay this what this program does is it programs the internal registers of the DS1307 to the present time uh, the way this works is it takes the r r system uh, time when the compiler is running and it uh, it uh, writes it via I square C okay so now let's go ahead and connect the Arduino and uh, let's see if this works or not. Okay, now let's connect the Arduino. It uh, should give me a green light. And now, what we'll be doing is we'll be uh, uploading the sketch. Uh, so let's go ahead and upload it. It should take a while. Okay, now it's finished uploading. So we go to Tools and then Serial, uh, serial Monitor. Okay, now that gives me an output which says that the DS1307 is uh, properly configured at and at this time and at date 26 Jan. So that means it's working properly and that we have successfully configured the chip. Now let's uh, use another example also provided with the library. It's called, uh, we go to examples tab and read test okay now let's program this as well okay once it has finished uploading uh, so we go to serial monitor again and we get the date and time in serial format so we have successfully programmed our DS1307 and also tested it with the Arduino IDE now we are free to go ahead and disconnect the I square C interface and now your circuit is ready to be used. Uh, one thing you have to remember is that this battery here has to be connected at all times. Otherwise, the chip will reset itself and you have to do the process all over again. Uh, so now you are ready to use your circuit in uh, whatever way you wish. So that was the second video on how do you add RDC interface to your next project. In the next video, we'll be implementing this into another project. So stay tuned. Catch you next time.